What's up everybody? Thank you for tuning into yet another episode of Rocket Vlogs. A little bit of a different setting, but I have to get a couple housekeeping things out of the way. Um, I'm on my way back from LDRS, unfortunately, uh, held up in a hotel room in New Mexico at the moment. Uh, before LDRS, I had a light cough, so I did some COVID tests before the launch, just because I wasn't going to go out there if I thought I was carrying COVID. Very light coughs and nothing, nothing extreme, and the tests were negative, so I went. Unfortunately, yesterday on Monday, I tested positive for COVID. Again, still feel pretty okay. I'm vaccinated, so I'm just, you know, taking Sudafed and uh, drinking a bunch of water. We're doing okay. Just a little stuffy, throat's a little scratchy, but the cough is mostly gone. We're doing okay. So, I just thought it'd be a responsible thing to let anybody know that uh, if you were at LDRS and you start feeling a little sick, it might not hurt to get a COVID test. The two people I was rooming with at LDRS did not get sick. So, at any rate, um, I'm going to go ahead and release the LDRS video early since I have a couple days to uh, edit it. Unfortunately, I didn't get to shoot a lot of stuff because my cameras were overheating and very unhappy with me for being in the desert. And uh, some of the shots have some good dust spots on the lens just because uh, it's Lucerne. If you've ever been there, you probably know what's going on. There was a little breeze there. Everything got dusty, but it's all right. I shot what I could. I used what I could. So here is that footage. Uh, if you see any video of your rocket and you would like to own that piece of footage, as usual, send me an email to rockyvlogs911 at gmail.com. It's a pay what you think is fair type thing. And... Uh, if you want to help support uh, my new hotel expenditure, check out rockyvlogs.com. I still have the I Literally Burned Money shirt available through the end of... You can check out the Patreon as well. And Patreon people are about to be in for a treat because I am on my way to Kansas City to uh, start constructing the big giant secret air fest project. And uh, there's going to be so many behind the scenes pictures and videos and clips and everything we're going to try to do we're getting this thing ready we have just over a week to build it and now we have a few less days because uh here i am so at any rate thank you guys for tuning in let me roll the ldrs footage Eyes clear. I don't, I've not heard Here we go, Richard. Five, four, three, two, one. 
Yeah. Oh, Brian, we uh, one of your launch rails. Uh, heads up, 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 Log Athena going up on it. H115. Metal Storm. Okay, Mr. James. Going up on E5. Going in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh. Oh. On day dos, on an I-2, 211. Ready, Mark? Here we go. Yeah, come on. Talk to this one. Guys, clear? No. Going in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Video on the uh, wild death or whatever. One of the motors was pressurizing. It was a dark night, so it was just doing uh, sparks all over the grass. The grass got fire. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, all right, come again. Oh, there we go. Left something behind. Yeah. And. Heads up, and here we go. Is your first time? Are you ready? Yep. Okay, going in five. Yeah. 
Calvin on that. Come on, shoot. Coming down on the west side, on the range. Heads up. Heads up and crash. Mr. Peter Pittnor is going for an altitude launch. The, uh, the rocket's name is the answer is. It's going on an I-1115. Sky is clear. Range is clear. Going in five, four, three, two, one. There it goes. Ready. Good to go. I was like 25 years old. One second, please. I know. We have an L motor on a wild man motor here. On an L1720. Again. Here we go, Daniel. San Diego. Going in. Five, four, three, two, one. It's arcing. There's an event. Shoots out. Saving these extensions to wire the E-matches. We got two CTI H226 skid marks in there. A J800 with a big Pyrodex pellet. And two G80s that are going to light together on the ground. And we're going to air start these guys. Hopefully it all goes well. Separation anxiety. I have no doubt. <laughs> we have a collection going here. We have a J800. A pair of G80s. And a pair of H226 skid marks. We're doing dual deploys, so we have a whole set of clusters. Here's rocking this down. Pat H5. Are ready on H5? Yes, sir. Five, four, three, two, one, launch. Um, the G80s and the J800 lit, so that's cool. Uh, one of the wires for the H226 got burned through, it came back out. And I assume because all the tape melted from sitting on the pad for 45 minutes. Uh, the wire came down, the J800 burned through it. The other one, uh, the E match lit, it just didn't light the motor, so whatever. We got three out of five, I've never done that. Never done a cluster before, so that's something. And it uh, deployed parachutes and didn't die. So uh, I got to figure out who's taking this thing. And also, uh, I have pretty much no footage of that flight. I have the footage from the big camera. This camera that I'm talking to right now was on the ground. And then uh, they lost my flight card. So they burned through the whole rack, didn't fly my rocket. And then they had to have me make a new flight card 
and then someone went out there and was setting up another rocket and turned my GoPro towards their rocket. I don't know why. So, oh, and the onboard camera overheated and shut off seven minutes in. So, beautiful weather out here, 105 degrees, but these things happen. At least we got the ground footage. This is, is uh, I definitely saw the G80's light first and it started moving very slowly and then the J came up to pressure. But it worked. So that's something. It went up and it went and it came back down. Anyway, um, rock is cool. I highly advise coming out here in the spring or fall. Otherwise it's really hot. People are gonna yell at me for using a lens cloth on the sensor now. You can't win in these situations. Do you want dots in the videos or not? The answer is not. Then you'll have to live with me mistreating my camera gear. All right, tell us your name. You signing it. Huh? You have to have the video, you signing it. I already signed it. You're signing it because you're taking it. Tell us your name. Jacob. All right, you're from Vegas. He's adopting the rocket called Separation Anxiety. It's going to its new home. So you gotta sign it? You gotta sign in the orange or yellow because it's black. The case is red, the pink is <laughs> But uh, yeah, so hopefully it flies on something cool and then gives it to somebody else. I messed that up, oh well. Yeah, well, you know, you'll You're get that on these big jobs. Yeah, it's yours, do whatever you want. My vote still goes to K700. K700. Or K1275. 